Alright, what's up guys? Bobby Blue here and I'm back with another reaction to a slap on Titan. This is episode 13, uh, Messiah Complex. Uh, last episode, uh, I want to say it was more of like a, a reflection episode for Aaron. He was having flashbacks of his family and uh, it ended with him, I guess, reassuring himself that he wanted to destroy all Titans. So let's see how it goes from there. Oh yeah, my boy was in trouble this too. Is, yeah, him right here. It's time to take responsibility for all the decisions that got me to this point. Yeah, I still blame Aaron. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. He was in trouble. The other two were looking for him. <laughs> Is that what the times are? They think they're drugs? That's funny. This is my chance. The corpses may be below my rank, but it will help me survive. God! Damn it! You unhelpful corpse! Why did I never learn how to take the bra off? That would have made this so much easier. Who tightens the straps this much? Triple laced? Are you fucking kidding me? Why is this stuck? What the fuck are you wearing? Are you this a chastity belt? Stupid corpse! This is Wait, wasn't that like me. one of their uh It was fastening the belt, right? That's what Aaron's test was about early on, right? What he can't unfasten it? Marco, you have a mess of fuck! Yeah, Marco! No means yeah, no Marco! <laughs> Okay, yeah. so they are helping. Honey, never give up on your dreams. Fuck this! Fuck today! Fuck that one! Fuck this year! Most importantly, fuck you! By the walls! Oh, we've made it! You are buying me new pants the second the shed is over! Everyone, look. Oh, the boulder. Aaron? <gasps> wow. Holy crap. Shove my blade up your stinking ass! <laughs> what the fuck? Did y'all just hear this move? He said he gonna shove a sword up my ass! He's trying to eat, man! Ain't no 
<laughs> we just trying to eat, man. He did it. Oh, wait. Oh. By the walls. He actually did it. Whew. I've been a massive bitch. Yeah, you have. And there you have it. Everything's fine. Should we send reinforcements? No. We've done enough as it is. Pictures like. More Titans are coming. <laughs> Evacuate. We need to get Aaron out first. Armin, is it rap? It's like trying to pull him out of a ravenous octopus. Look! Wait, so what happens to this big Titan body Listen, once he's pulled out? Does it just bears. disappear? Don't have time for head time. Wait! <laughs> Ew. Oh, it's this guy. One of the things he's too cool for everybody. Humanity's greatest once again stands victorious. That's right, bitches. The Duke is back. <laughs> the Colossus Titan used to throw wicked waves before he switched to full time murder. Night live in the Fruit crushers. Fruit gushers. Oh, fruit gushers. Squeeze him to the. Blood of the pops out. War, the remaining cadets were able to safely evacuate Trost. It took a full day of cannon fire to eradicate the remaining Titans within the city. Oh, they're trying to kick us off the party! It's closing time! Closing time! Oh man, you got the nailed. The cost of the operation was enormous. Over 200 soldiers were killed and more than 800 wounded. Oh. But for the first time in history, humanity had won against the Titans. Bring out your dead! History. Bring out your dead! Time to sneak off for the lesser peons do all the work. Hmm? <laughs> no. No, it can't be. Marco? Is that you? But I, I saw you. Marco. In the wall with me. 
Marco. How could you be here? Or, or half of you at least. Oh, man. Now that you've had a near-death experience, have you considered accepting me as your Lord and Savior? You're not a prophet, Marco. But I am. And one day I will be eaten for your sins. I can finally spread my message of peace through the populace. Let me know anytime you want to talk about your sins. Accept me into your life. No. No. By the walls. It was true. It was all true. You sweet, freckled messiah. How could I not have believed? Oh wow, so yeah, he actually well I'll I'll be eaten for you. Yeah, he actually came through. Titan vomit. They don't have digestive organs, so when they're full they throw up and keep eating. Yeah. Oh, so guys, this might not be a great time to ask, but is this something we can eat? Jesus Christ! Pile? What? I'm hungry. What the fuck is wrong with you? Uh, uh, where am I? Who are Wait, you're Commander Irwin, and you're, you're Captain Levi. Oh my god, you guys are my heroes. Well, would you look at that, Irwin? We're his heroes. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> I'm like your biggest fan. <laughs> he probably has posters of us in his room. I do. Teenage boys usually have posters of girls in their room. He has us. That means nothing. Imagine him just jacking it every night to your face. Levi, stop. Just going in, just <coughs> throttling that rooster, shooting loads all over those bushy eyebrows of yours. Oh my god. Are you picturing it, Irwin? Levi, are you picturing it, Irwin? Because I've got a pretty vivid image in my head. Is he usually like this? He's been drinking. Seriously, look at his face right now. He looks like Helen Keller the first time she touched water. Levi! His tears probably taste like poetry. I ordered you to stop. Oh, look, my name's Baby Dick, and I can turn into a titan. Let's all forget about the Duke of Destruction over here and worship Justin Bieber. Who's Justin Bieber? A pop singer. A fucking asshole. By the walls, Levi, compose yourself! No, Erwin, because unlike Puss and Poots over here, I actually kick ass just fine on my own. <laughs> Why do they have him locked up? I just made a Shrek joke. You make a lot of references. I am like the king of references. Shrek is love. You know, this is not how I imagined meeting my heroes. Who cares, baby dick? I apologize. Wow. Will you please stop talking, Levi? Sure, whatever. Do your thing. It'll just give me more time to think of one-liners. Thank God. All right, Aaron. You've been in prison for the time being until the military decides what to do with you. Some fear you, but we know the truth. You're no titan. This is the second time that Aaron's done a lot. Look closely. As a titan. We took this off your comatose body. Can you tell me what this is? A key. No. Oh, it's a destiny. According to your comrades, this his is dad gave him that key. To defeating the titans. Well, amongst other things, uh, yes. If that is the case, then I want to make you an offer. You have already proven yourself a valuable asset in the fight against the titans. Ever since the attack on Wall Maria and the loss of the Outer Ring, we have been on the defensive. I want to use you to turn our situation around. I want to use you so that we may take back the world that was stolen from us. I want you, Aaron, to join us in the Survey Corps. Here's the key to the Dick, my face! Stand so dick, nigga! I feel on my boss! He'll, he'll join. I accept your offer, Commander. Yeah. I'll join the Survey Corps. Oh, man. I'll kill all the Titans, and the entire world will know me as Aaron Yeager, Savior of Humanity. Wait. His last name is Yeager? Yes. This changes everything. Yeager Bow! <laughs> I can't believe that is your name. <laughs> Oh my god, kid, you are so fun. What, uh, what does he, uh... All right, Erwin, I'm cool with him. Kid, for the time being, just think of me like your older brother. You know, except for that, if you turn into a titan, I'll kill you. But don't, don't worry about that. Oh, I'm kind of worried all... Shut up. All you need to know is that your last name is fucking awesome, and we are going to do so many shots together. <laughs> yeah, you bow! <laughs> fucking unbelievable. Buckle up, buttercup. Because once you're in, we are going to fucking party. <laughs> oh my god.
All right, guys, that was episode 13. Uh, another great episode of Art for the series, man. All right, so it looks like uh, Aaron's going to join this uh, squad. I think that's part of this squad, those two guys. Uh, Marco's dead. I keep forgetting one guy's name, though. But uh, we'll see where it goes next time. But if you guys enjoyed my reaction, hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time.